Hello, it is me. Um, I have decided to make one last video before I go out on my on my trip. <laughs> before I go to the actual coast to coast path and cross, um, see how strong I am. See if I can really do it. Cross the UK, Northern England on foot. Um, and I decided to, I chose to make this video for you up here on Goat Hill um, because Goat Hill has been like a huge part of this journey for me. Um, it's been like, at first it was a place that I couldn't find. And I got lost coming up here, searching for it, thrashing through the woods, feeling mad and upset and scared and exhilarated and joyful. and you know, laughing about how, you know, there was a day that Jay, my son and I got up, came up here and we had the best day not finding it. But then I got home and was full of like all the judgment about like, what if I killed my son by losing him in the woods or something, right? And, um, and now when I come here, I just feel such peace and solace. I come to these woods for comfort now. It's really so interesting how much, of, how much I've changed as this journey has gone along. And um, I've really come to see uh, this last year, because it's been almost exactly a year now since I was asked the question, how do you want to feel in a year? And it's been such an exploration, not just of, it really started with like my relationship with food, my relationship with my body. Um, and it's become such an interesting exploration of my own identity. Um, and who am I and who do I want to be? <laughs> it's been so, what do I want to do with my time? And how do I want to live? Like if, if it, to be invited to explore these questions and if I look back, I mean, there have been times where I think if I wasn't already on this journey, I probably wouldn't have started it. <laughs> it's been so interesting. And um, ultimately, I'm so glad I did start it because it's been really joyful. And um, I now understand that like I have two states of being. One is caught up in thoughts and the other, it, I think of it as joyful, patient, contentment. Uh, sorry, joyful, patient, serenity is mine. Jay's is, um, Jay has a, a feeling state that he likes to be in and that um, one of those words is like, I. But, you know, I'm, it's not mine to share, but the, one of those words is contentment for him. So, um, and when I'm in my place of joyful, patient serenity, like everything is better. It's the place where I go to solve problems. It's the place where I go to, um, just be happy. Right. And like, it's really interesting. Uh, it feels backwards. It feels like, how can you, how can that be where you go to solve problems? How can you get into that state of mind to solve problems? And I'll tell you, when I'm not there and there and problems present themselves, it's a mess. It is such a mess. So I've learned. And, um, I, I guess my ultimate message here for, for you is just one of profound and deep gratitude. Um, I don't think I would have started this journey without you. Um, like I, I, it means so much to me that you have been cheering me on, that you've, you've shared that I'm an inspiration to you in those moments where I'm like, how can I possibly be an inspiration to anyone? Cause this is a messy process. <laughs> Boy, is it messy. And to have you embrace me and tell me that like you love me and um, to get those messages of love and support means the world. Um, a lot of the time that is meant, or at least some of the time, significant amount of the time that is meant um, you've donated to my GoFundMe um, and between the GoFundMe and like other avenues of support, financial support, like um, we've now got this trip through crowdfunding, we've now got this trip. Like there's been about $3,000 worth of support for this trip. That means that my flight has been entirely paid for. That's a huge chunk of my lodging as I go across. And um, I just am so grateful for that. And I, I've just recently, I've now got, cause I'm gonna be creating art 
um, along the way. So I'm going to be doing some drawing. I'm going to be doing some pastel painting. I have got, I've just been able to purchase the most kick-ass plein air set of pastels that I, they arrive tomorrow and I cannot wait to, I am so excited about this. Um, and that was GoFundMe money that I used to purchase that. Like that was crowdfunded. Um, so I will be making paintings and I will be thinking of you the whole time. Every, every night when I go to sleep on this trip, I will be thinking of you. When I'm on the plane back and forth, I will be thinking of you. Um, I'm going to be carrying you with me. Um, and it goes so much deeper than money. I mean, I'm going to be carrying you with me for the feelings of it, right? And the love. Um, I'm going to be posting. So uh, I'm going to be posting. I've chosen to post in Instagram and in LinkedIn. So I'm at we turned out OKAY in Instagram. And in LinkedIn, um, you can search K Lock Culp. Um, I'm going to be dropping links wherever I can. Uh, so they'll be on my website. They'll be in. Um, you know, in all the places where I would ordinarily post. And the cool thing about Instagram is that it will also post to, I can also post these to my Facebook, like we turned out okay page. Um, so if you're in Facebook, I don't know how this works, but you can find me in Facebook. Uh, there's a, we if you search, we turned out okay, a Y, you can find me there. Um, because I really would love to take you along with me as I'm doing this. I, I, I intend to, you know, post in pictures and 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 maybe videos if I can do that um and just share with you while I'm while I'm on my journey uh because you're a part of this too and I'm excited to bring you along so um huge huge thanks um so joyful and excited we are about two weeks out from my flight um, I'm going to be posting about my training as I go along uh it's been such a wild ride it continues to be um when problems and challenges crop up I'm doing my best. I'm not perfect at this, but I'm doing my best to be in my place of joyful patient serenity. And um, we're going, you know what I mean? So um, we're on the path. <laughs> I am, my father said it best. Um, he was so cute. He was listening to me and listening to me. And then he says to me, you know what? <laughs> you need to get out of your head. <laughs> You're too much in your head. Stop overthinking. Don't get injured before you go. Do your best to not get injured before you go. Go and have fun. Go and have fun, he says to me. Um, both my parents are like, I love you. And uh, we got off the phone last night and I was feeling really good and happy. So I'm out back in the woods today. Um, I'm training. I will see you on the trail. I love you. Thank you so much for being here. Um, I'll see you soon. Bye.